Hello everybody and welcome back to the Briar Rock 75. I'm Brian Lee and today we have another very first on this channel. Anybody know what's happening? Hmm, you're about to find out. Hey guys, and welcome back to the Bright Rock 75. As I said, I am Brian Lee, and today we have something new again. I love doing something new for you guys, and I'm really excited about this one because I honestly had just never thought about it. But today, we are here with the Wizard's Vault by Bippity. Now, I knew since I've signed up with Bippity that they had a Wizard Vault, if you're not familiar with Bippity or all of their options, I will link their website down below. So make sure you go check it out if you're interested in their Disney-based boxes or Marvel or Star Wars or Harry Potter. They have them all on that website for you. But before we get into this box, I do want to say if you are new to this channel, welcome. I'm so glad you're here. Today is going to be a lot of fun because this is new for us. Typically, we do subscription box openings, but they're all Disney-based and a couple that are non-Disney-based. But this is really exciting. It's our very first Harry Potter one, and I'm really super excited about it, especially for my husband, Jackson, because I ordered this box just for him. This is his box. Yes, he is in the room with me. He is watching this opening, but I am going to be the one doing it on camera, but all of the stuff in here is for him specifically. I get so many wonderful Disney things from different companies. I wanted to do something very special for him because he is always, always so supportive of my Disney habits and my Disney spending. And I wanted to do something that would be really special for him and give him some merchandise that he loves. And he is a hardcore Potter fan, just like I am. And we are both Gryffindor. He is a much stronger Potter fan than I am. His knowledge is way better than mine. So there may be some things I don't know, but we're about to find out. If you're a returning rock star, welcome back. Hopefully you're here and you're living for this. I'm excited about it. Um, as you know, Bippity puts out Wizard's Vault and I'm very stoked to see what it is. So without wasting any more time, let's see what we got. Revealio. All right, so it looks like we've got a packing slip and some tissue paper. Let me go ahead and set this box down so we can do this a little bit easier here. Now, I am unfamiliar with Wizard's Vault uh, other than what I've seen on channels. This is my very first time looking at Wizard's Vault, so I'm actually really excited. First things first, on our top, we have a card here. This says, happiness can be found even in the darkest of times. If one only remembers to turn on the light, Albus Dumbledore. So that's the awesome quote from Dumbledore. I love that. I think it's beautiful and it's so true. When you're having a bad day and things are grim and dark, just turn on the light, All right? And our box today was packed by Becky. I have had one Bippity box done by Becky and it was unreal. So I'm really excited to see what Becky does today with our Wizard's Vault box. Here's our packing slip. We're gonna stick that straight to the side. We don't want any spoilers. And here we have a different car or a different sticker. This one is the Wizard Vault sticker. I love it there. It looks like the wax stamps. Alright, here we go, guys. I'm already seeing something. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm excited. I cannot even believe or wait to see what Jackson says about this. Okay. So we're gonna go for the first thing that I see here. And this is a baseball cap. Let me go ahead and take it out of the packaging. Here we have a, this is one of those soft baseball caps and it says Quidditch Team Captain. <gasps> that is so cool. I love that it, it's not really distressed, but the coloring is kind of faded. So it looks like it has been well worn. Um, it's the adjustable back with the little slide right there, as you can see. Jackson typically doesn't like floppy hats, but I think he'll probably like this one. It is a, a floppier hat, but not too bad. Um, but it's, it's nice. This is all like stitched on, embroidered, but look at the bill. I love it. It is the symbol for Hogwarts. That is so cool. 
if he don't like this hat, I certainly will. <laughs> I love it. So I think that's a good start. Let's see what this is. Oh, oh, okay. Whoa, this is gonna be tough. Guys, this is a puzzle. It is a Gryffindor, the tag just came off. It is a Gryffindor puzzle. That's what it's gonna look like of the Gryffindor emblem. It's 150 pieces, which is a substantial piece puzzle, but it's in this. I'm gonna get it closer. I know there's a glare, but guys, look at the size of those pieces. Um, this is going to be so hard. Can you see that? That's gonna be so tricky. We do like puzzles. We just recently really got into puzzles, to be honest, with the whole pandemic and COVID. And we decided, you know, eh, let's give it a shot and see what happens. And um, we actually found that we liked puzzles. We have been doing some Thomas Kincaid's. So this one's gonna be fun. It's gonna be small. Um, but you know what? I think with it being that small, we should be able to frame it in like a five by seven frame, maybe. Yep. So it's actually, this puzzle is actually gonna be four inches by six inches. So we can frame that in like a four by six frame or maybe do a five by seven with a little border around it. And this will make some really neat um, Harry Potter art because we don't have any. So this is gonna be really awesome. All right guys, from what I can tell, we have one more item in this box. So let's do it. I see a box. Do you see what I see? Jackson is gonna lose his mind. You're probably gonna hear him gasp on camera in just a minute. I was really hoping that this would end up in this box because I have seen it on some other channels. Um, my friend Thomas has one for his house and I was really hoping we were gonna get this. So, are you guys ready for this? Revealio! Oh my gosh, guys. <gasps> Look at this goblet. It is a Gryffindor house goblet. First of all, the detail. Oh man. It's got the Gryffindor emblem there with the house colors of red and gold. As I pull it up, look at the base. Even the base is detailed with some um, leaves and some scroll work. It has um, these ruby stones on it that sparkle and shine here on the base, here on the base, and then right here across the top as well. This is stainless steel, and it's actually pretty deep. It, it's hard to see the dimension there, but it does go all the way down to here. So that is a substantial goblet, and it's heavy. This thing is heavy, y'all. Oh, man. I just don't even know. This is the, it just, it just says on the bottom, it just says Harry Potter, Gryffindor. Whoa. I am so excited about this. Oh my God. I don't even know how to explain my happiness right now. This is gorgeous. All right, guys. So I believe that is everything out of the box. Three items. Now, I will say this was actually the Wizard's Vault silver box. So it was right around the $40 mark. Um, I just wanted to try it out. I didn't want to do the most expensive Harry Potter box because there are two different levels. There's Wizard Vault and Wizard Vault Silver. So I went down to the Wizard Vault Silver to give it a try. I just wanted to see what kind of Harry Potter items were there. And honestly, for this price point, I'm really impressed. So let's look at our packing slip and see what we have. And yes, there were three items, so we're good. So first of all is the Harry Potter 150 piece Gryffindor puzzle. That was the one in the little tube. That was $9.99. Next up, our Gryffindor Harry Potter goblet, which is so beautiful. That was $35. And then the Harry Potter Quidditch pigment dyed hat, that was $22.99. Our box value, $67.98. And I believe this box is at $45, I think is the price point. It's, it's no more than 50. I wanna say it's 45, somewhere around in there. Uh, but I will link the website down below in the description so that way you can go check it out. This is the Wizard Vault Silver. 
I'm very happy with this. I love the product. I think everything we got is absolutely beautiful. That goblet is stunning. Thank you, Becky. Yep, you did it. Um, I will say I'm going to continue getting this box for a few months because I really want Jackson to be able to build up his Harry Potter collection. And I think this is a great way to do that without being able to go to the parks and getting the actual merchandise from the parks. I think this is great. So I'm so very excited with this wonderful decision. So I'm very happy about it. And I will continue this at least for a couple of more months, I think. And let's build up and see what we get, right? So thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. Again, I will link down below um, the Bibbidi website so you can go check out and see if you want your very own Wizard Vault box. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know what was your favorite item. What's something that you would like to get or what is something that you have gotten out of Wizard Vault box that you really enjoyed? Um, if you haven't already, please click that subscribe button. Become a part of the Rockstar family. I would love to have you here all the time and hit the bell notification. That way you always know when I'm uploading new content for you. All right, guys. So before I close out completely, I do want to talk a little bit about my wand here. Uh, this wand is actually very special for me because this came from Ollivanders in the beginning of the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. So I actually... My niece and I had went into Ollivanders and I was selected for the wand ceremony and blew my mind. And this is the wand that chose me. It is a 12 inch reed wood dragon heartstring core. Um, surprisingly swishy. <laughs> so I am, I, I love it. I honestly don't get to use this wand enough. So the fact that we ordered the wizard's vault today and i was going to get to use my wand was a win so as always guys thank you so much for tuning in and watching i really hope you enjoyed this video today if you did like this wizard Vault opening let me know because i we are definitely going to do more of these okay as always guys i want you to go out do good be good feel good and be the change that you want to see because it is up to us until next time I'll see you real soon. Lumos Knox.